Hey YouTubers, this is Keely Day 6, aka Raymond. Now, I've done all the um, Psycho Dad montages, but I think I'll stop because I just saw this and the other video. I'd like to talk to you about this, but now let you guys know what really what happened in this in this clip is that uh he trapped him in a cocoon. Take a look. Now, let you guys know, he actually <coughs> put, uh, he put, he hung a, um, his PlayStation 4, the same way that he did with, uh, Jeffrey's, uh, Batman statue. And now, well, what happened to him, Korn, who's recording, actually pushed him in the pit, and now, uh, Jess is actually strung up. Now, he agreed to let him go on one condition, he has to buy him a new motorcycle. Now, watch what happens after when, uh, he was down. I mean, I just saw the Raptor for a little bit. Chris Pratt drives it. Oh, that's how they lost the Raptor. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm just going to talk to you about how excited I am for my motorcycle. This is crossing the line. Now, he said he, that this is crossing the line. Now, let's remind everyone about the, um, what happened between these two. He took his he took his uh, Batman trophy and co had Corn push him over. Now that's crossing the line. Now when he tied him up with help with the help of Corn, <coughs> he crossed the line. So why is it that he gets upset and he's laughing, and now he's upset and he's laughing? Now these guys are as bad as each other. Now watch what happens when Jeff. What Jeffrey does to his brother. Wow. I'm glad. What are we gonna do? Is this annoying? Is this annoying? I swear to God, if you need to talk to me, get out of my way. Now, right here, that's crossing the line. Oh, 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 what's that? Is that annoying? What? Give me your back. What the fuck? Is that annoying? Now, that is wrong right there. Now, you know, <clears throat> I always talk shit about uh, Jesse because the way that he treats his brother and everything, but he's the big, Jeffrey is the big brother and he did that to his brother's glasses. Now, when Jess says that he's like a bully, now he is a bully. Now, what really happened really surprised me. And Cor's just watching this. Now watch what happens. They are chorus fighting, and look what happens. What what uh, Jess does. Watch what Jess does. Get the fuck off him! Now that really shocked me. Jess actually grabbed a bottle and knocked him out with in in the head. <coughs> I can't believe that. You know, believe me when I tell you this, but um, when Jeffrey and Jess were fighting, I say that was good for them because um, they've been arguing back and forth, back and forth, and um, I guess they had all that, uh, Jess has all that anger thinking that, why are we doing this? This is my brother. And they fought. And Jess just did that, swiped his glasses off his face. Who? What kind of a brother does that? Now, the funny thing is, they recorded, he recorded another video. 
that really shocked me. You know, brothers, you can't live with you can't live with them. You can't live without them. In other words, you're stuck with them. But it's it's kind of sad that those two were fighting each other. Now think about what happens if mom, if their mom and dad were gone. They got each other, and that's all they're gonna be. And is this prank war is gonna go on? And he even had Cord was helping him out, fighting his brother. And what does he do? He smacks him in the head with a bottle. That was crossing the line right there. He may have crossed the line by pulling that prank, but just crossed the line by smacking his brother in the head with a bottle. Now, give me one second. I'm going to show you another clip of from the uh, new video that just happened. Now, believe it or not, uh, Jeffrey is fine. But now, he they dragged him in a dog kennel, locked him up, because they feared that Jeffrey was going to do it again. But now, Jeffrey, Jeff has a kind heart because he wants to make, see if they can move forward from this and stop this war. And to make matters worse, he actually grabbed his um, play button that he earned. He uh, His uh, big, uh, big Brother uh, account actually reached up to 600000 So around 500 k he actually got an award. So he brought that over since Jess took his one millionth award. So watch what happens when two brothers are, tr uh, when Jess is trying to make up with his big brother. That's the first thing you say. After being out here this long, we're going to be out here fucking all week then. Right. I'm fine. Now I'll let you guys know, their mom and dad actually went on a trip for a week. And these two were left alone. Not, not a good way to, to start a day without your parents. <coughs> Fighting each other. Having your friend fight your brother, and you smacking his brother with a bottle. But take a look at what happened that really surprised me. We can pitch a tent. We really could. Eagles landing too. We can fucking make it right here. You want to play this, dude? I think Dad's gonna be okay with that. Dad, Dad's not gonna know you're out here. We can fucking put insulation all around here. We can build a second room. I can get Uncle Larry over here. He'd have no problem doing that. You think? You think? You think? This is what you have to say, dude? I might just fucking smash this. You think we're going to be good someday? I mean, I would like to. I would like to move forward, but if you're not communicating, if you're not helping us out here, we're not going anywhere. Yeah, we're not when you say that. Okay, and I can say shit that you've done to me and say we're never going to be good. Or what did I ever do to you? What did you ever do to me? Really? The fucking videos on your channel, you wouldn't have all the subs if it wasn't for me. That's me, Jesse. Me. Mm. I always had to go through everything. Ever since we were kids. I was the oldest child. Yeah. Everything was on me. All, all of Dad's little parenting ideas, they were tested on me. Not you. It wasn't until you fucking graduated college you started paying attention to you. Fucking lucky. Fucking lucky? What are you, I'm lucky? Hey, you're fucking lucky. All the shit he's destroyed of mine, and I'm the lucky one? Oh. Rethink you that. Poor thing. Jesse, I've What's had that? a part time job since I was fucking 12. I had to do sports almost constantly. And that was your choice. I did basketball, baseball, soccer, cross country. Your crap. choice! Was it? Was it? Or was it Dad's choice? Did you have to go through any of that shit? Did you have the pressure of constantly having to take all of your fucking time and just put it towards things that he was interested in? No, you fucking did it. Because you were the young child. Nobody really cared. Your mom's favorite, sure. Never got that kind of favoritism. That's... I just got all dad's attention. Okay. Yeah, look. That's really what this is. You're gonna go into all this, dude? This is the past, man. And of course. Like, sure, I get a full-time job. Right out of college. Everything's great for Jeffrey. But is that what Jeffrey really wanted? You think he wanted to go to school for accounting? The guy fucking know. sucks! I, okay, I didn't know. Uh, okay. I didn't know what he wanted to do. I don't know. what I really wanted to do? No. Did you know that, Jesse? But no. So you, with my help, skyrocket. 
pocket it too. What are you at? 2.1 million now? You get all the credit. Everything goes to Jesse. Everything works out fine for Jesse. What is Chef for you? You see him chill the fuck out, dude. Chef, you're making this. Game? He never wants it. Yeah. That's what I get. That's what I get! Dude, come on, man. You have a child now. What you do? I didn't. I didn't know all that. Wow. You know what's funny? <clears throat> you know, brothers and and siblings, older and younger siblings. It's hard. Hey, I'm I'm the oldest. My, I have two brothers. One is a year and a month younger than me, and the other is six years and two months younger than me. I I can understand how Jess, uh, Jeffrey feels. He had all this pressure on him as an as a, a, a older kid, but Jeffrey didn't have much, didn't have much to look forward to from his dad. His dad was too busy. Pay attention to Jeffrey instead of uh, Jess. I guess that's why uh, his dad is so hard on him so much. But you know, it's funny. Brothers are not supposed to be enemies. You guys are supposed to be a team. Stick together. And see, look at look how Jess is right now. <clears throat> he never knew how uh, Jeffrey feels. And that's sad. That is very sad. And he wanted to film. Jeffrey wanted to film instead of doing accounting. And now he started to realize that he recorded all the stuff for him and he never thanked him. You know, in all the videos that we've seen, I've never seen him thank his brother for uploading it. He may have gotten angry with him when he uploaded some videos that made him a laughing stock of the school. But look at him now. He's famous on YouTube. <clears throat> Even though his brother got his own channel. But he's never thanked him for all this all the stuff he did in the past. On the other videos. Which really got me right there. But seeing how he how he stares at him all smiling and ang he is angry. And now he's finally letting it out. But what 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 really uh grabbed me right there? was what Jess said. I mean, you can say all that all you want, but that still doesn't change the fact that you've done shit to me. A lot of shit. Yeah. Does he deserve it? You're saying I, I did deserve it? I, was that sarcasm? I don't know. So you did you you have, so, so you did you have all that if it wasn't for me, Jesse. Oh, so that's what it is. It's all out of jealousy. Because I had what you couldn't. Okay, I get it. Dad did just handed all these things. I wasn't you handed. Work I wasn't for it. Me, I put on a fucking work in all the fucking time. I want all this shit. Nothing. Yeah, we're never gonna be fucking good. Even when he argues, he always takes your side, and you know it. It's because I know how to deal with him. Because I've been dealing with him all my life, and you have. That's true. Oh no, I know. That's true. I've been dealing a lot with him as of, as of, as of the last fucking year, year and a half. Doesn't compare. Doesn't okay, compare okay, at all. okay. So I didn't get a whole fucking lifetime of him pushing sports and him pushing fucking getting a job, but I've really dealt with it. Okay. I've dealt with it in a short period of time. You may have had a whole lifetime of it, a lot of exposure, but he's crammed, fucking packed all that into like the last two years ever since I graduated. And it was fucking hard, okay? I had to work hard for this YouTube. You had like it was easy. You could just put a fucking video out and everybody views it and you have lots of subscribers and everyone's fucking rich and happy. It's hard fucking work and it's hard when you gotta put your whole family's problems for the world to see. I did! 
He did take the credit for it. And you're part of it too! I mean, you have a channel! I was giving you shout outs! It wasn't the right way to do it though! We could actually be a good team! If that's what you want to pursue, then we can pursue it together! If you can't beat me, then join me! Let's do it together! Let's make videos! I know Dad can be fucking crazy! I know it! I've seen it! I've dealt with it! Mom's dealt with it! But that's why we're brothers! That's why we can move past it! Because we both dealt with that shit! I can't compare! I really can't! I can't compare it to dealing with it throughout childhood! I, I'm sure that does something to you! But I mean, it's done something to me too! I look to you! I look to you as an example! I'm like, oh, older brother! And yeah, I may not have agreed with some of your choices, but I still look to you on how to react! And I don't want to react this way! Here, look! I'm putting this down! I am sorry I even grabbed it! But look, this isn't gonna work! We can't do this! We can't be rolling around fucking fighting, pranking each other left and right! We could be good together! And I've tried this, I've tried it before and you just weren't receiving it and I get it, I get it, you can have all this fucking jealous hate towards me, but... I mean, it's not worth it. If we like, if you wanted shoutouts to your channel, I could have shot you out in a positive way if we were working, just working in the same direction, not... I mean, I didn't know all that. I didn't... I mean, obviously I wasn't around for a few years. When you, had, when you were getting raised and... I know mom's always taking my side and... I didn't know all that. I mean, I do, I understand. I mean, when we had the fucking therapy session, I don't know why you couldn't tell <coughs> Dr. Nelson all that. Why don't you open up, you know, then? Why do you have to wait till, like, fucking ends of the earth to tell me this? Because I was supposed to keep my promise to myself. I want to let you out, but I'm not going to do anything. I can't believe I. <clears throat> I mean, you understand. <laughs> What do you mean? I'm not, I'm not doing anything. I, I, you expect me to believe that? What, what do you mean? I haven't done. I haven't. I'm not going to do it. What do you mean? What am I going to do? I okay, but I mean that was then. That like I said, I, I react, and that I was in a tough spot. Are you gonna play nice, and we can let you out? And he, then, he was. He I mean, was in a tough spot. He, so then you're, he had no choice. I mean, did you find the key for this one? Alright. <clears throat> He's probably over there somewhere. Could you give us a second? Here, come. Let's cool right, that so, he did let him out. And just look, I'm not like not trusting you, but I do have your play button. And clearly that matters more than I thought it did. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm I wish I knew all this about you, dude. We just don't talk like that. <coughs> Alright, so, now where do we go from here? That montage. Then you're going to make that a montage? That's not happening, right? Doesn't exist. What do you mean? You never made it? <laughs> you never even fucking made it. <laughs> Now, if you guys are wondering about this montage thing, Jeffrey was going to make a montage of his brother making fun of his dad on every single video. Now, what's really interesting about this uh, clip here, Prisoner of War, but how they talk, uh, talked about what they called it, it's just, Wow. Jeffrey has been pushed by his dad to do all these things as a little kid. As for me, I never got pushed to do all this. I chose to do what I wanted to do. My parents 
You know, this makes me so lucky to have parents that love me and understand me and lets me do what I want to do. But for them, this dad, his dad started doing all that ever since when uh, he ran his games over with a lawnmower, saying this is what he wanted to do. <clears throat> this was his job. And of course, Jeffrey was jealous. The Green Eye Monster really got to him very badly doing all this stuff. He did destroy his camera in the very first, uh, in the second video. And he got back at him, but it didn't work. He destroyed his TV with his paintball because <clears throat> he thought he pranked, he thought he destroyed his play button, which he didn't. He took that off. I think he was upset because he worked hard for that. But, like he said, doing this YouTube thing, it, it's very hard. But, you know, seeing all this, vi all the videos of uh, that one where they reached 500K, where uh, he said that award was his because he uploaded some of the videos, I think that's what drove Jeffrey at this way, all the way up to now. He got an award. He got an award for the award was for five hundred K for Mid Juggernauts, but it wasn't under his name. So Jeffrey decided to do his own video. And guess what? He got a hundred K, which is great. Also, he reached up to five hundred K, got another award. He worked hard for that. Now, as for the as for what I believe is going to happen after this, could be uh, two things. At the end of this video, he does keep the 500k, his 500k video, uh, play button, <coughs> because he knows that Jeffrey has his one millionth play button, or two millionth, either one, either or. So I have a feeling that Jeffrey might, I'm hoping he will, give it back to him, and so he'll give back his 500k play button. What do you guys think? After seeing all that fighting and seeing them argue, yelling at each other, this is how bro how bro this is that this family brothers. You know, me and my brothers we fight a lot, but you know it's funny we get along the next day. We don't hold grudges. After watching this, it makes me feel lucky how I have two great brothers who. Love me and respect me, and I love them and respect them the same way. What do you guys think? Now, all the other montages, I said bad things about Jess. Uh, I don't know if if Midjunganus or it, it ever watches this. I apologize for saying all those mean things to you. I said all those mean things because you fought your brother, you smacked him in the head with a with a bottle. But after seeing that. You guys talked talked it through. You were able to let him out. Hey, brothers fight. Family does that. And this and this war, I'm hoping that this war will be over. This may be a new start. But it depends on how Jeffrey is going to take this. We'll never know. We'll never know. But overall, could be a new start. Hopefully it will be. Hey, thank you guys for watching my video. Comment and, comment and tell me what, if you think what I'm saying is true. If not, no biggie. And as always, you stay positive.